Okay, I already apply my new kind of favorite moisturizer. This is Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. This is for dry and extra dry skin. And I'm so in love with this product right now. I get it 50 milliliters because first I wanted to try it and then to see if this works really good to my skin. I was gonna buy the bigger size. But this is the smaller one and I love, love, love this with this moisturizer my face looks even more better to the day um it's not get oily it's gonna give enough moisturizer and i love it so so gorgeous and also works really good for the primer i really love this one and today i'm using double wear light as the louder foundation with my sigma f80 brush which is my favorite brush for this foundation i kind of press it everywhere this gives full, not full coverage but definitely medium to buildable i don't want to put too much makeup on and i put just one Jump layer use. of it it's my healthy mix by borgia um concealer this is in 51 I'm gonna apply right this. This is so opaque color and very, very good coverage. I put it just in my nose because today I get redness and kind of press it with my fingers. I love this concealer. This concealer stay in the place where you put all day long. Don't even crease because I have so much fine lines around my under, especially under my eyes in this corner right here. And this don't go into the lines. Stay perfectly all day long. It's one of the best concealers ever. I'm so, so um, into to get very beautiful coverage under my eyes because I have so bad dark circles and I really want that long lasting power uh, concealer this is the best concealer ever okay first I'm gonna take eyeliner and kind of create a line It's not necessary to be perfect because I'm going to blend this. And make it where you want to be end of the eyeshadows. Like this. And smudge with your fingers or with the brush. I'm gonna smudge with my fingers a little bit in the center. On my end, I'm gonna smudge with the brush because it's kind of delicate part. You need to be clean. Also, this is going to be like base. Next eyeshadow, which I'm gonna use, it's L'Oreal Infallible Eyeshadows. This is 015 Flashback Silver looks like this and I'm gonna apply that into the corner but not going too much in that part kind of to have space for the highlight right there because I already put black uh, kind of base this it's not going to be like um, very silver is going to bring the more the eyeshadow next eyeshadow which i'm gonna use is orb by mac which is very very kind of a light eyeshadow but for my eye call uh, eye tan i tan <laughs> for my skin color this is kind of a little bit darker and it's going to make it very very good kind of blending effect I'm using with E35 brush and I'm gonna use that on top of the blending silver which I already applied in that part okay my eyes today are super super red and i need to go out 
and I decided to film a tutorial for this look to do not be wasting too much time to kind of but it's okay this is uh, Kiko by Milano one of my favorite black eyeshadows lovely eyeshadow if you can find Kiko by Milano try to find this brush by the way this says like this 28 it's super sparkly black eyeshadow this is my favorite black ever and I'm gonna put that right here because right here we don't even put any eyeshadow just the eyeliner and make it a little bit more right now you need to be sure that your both eyes are the same shape to do not have like very very long part up here and very short in the other side it's necessary to be the same kind of shape also i will gonna apply the black under my eyes close to your waterline do not go very very down and kind of continued with your upper okay I already apply white eyeshadow in my corner and just a little bit into my brow bone next which I'm gonna use is by this graphic garden and the first one is social clumber which is white but have very frosty like it's kind of duochrome it's more like pinkish beautiful pinkish iridescent light and I'm gonna put that probably you will not able to see the pinky reflex but definitely have the beautiful pink reflex because I'm going out out with this makeup I will not going to put false eyelashes I wear it false eyelashes just in the tutorials on YouTube in every day I don't even wear it and uh, next is this very very beautiful iridescent it looks like white but um, shimmer it's like a turquoise uh, green purplish very very like different dimensions and I'm gonna put just right here I will not going to put any base or something because this stay where you put it all day long like this and this eyes are done you're ready to go to your prom night going or where you want okie dokie right now I will go with the face I'm gonna use this is 17 bronzer but definitely you can use anything you want with this Sigma F30 brush which is powder brush very very huge brush but I love it for bronzer because it gives very natural effect on the skin for my cheeks today I will gonna do use a rosy pinkish um, blush but I put a little bit more bronzer this is going to give enough color to my face I'm not going to put bronzer everywhere like for every day I want you to be more concentrate in this part up here okay okay and our deco 29 which is my favorite 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 blush ever it's beautiful rosy pink color it's just incredibly good 
I put it directly on my cheeks rosy cheeks like this I don't want to put too much but definitely I want to put because on top of it I will gonna put my highlight and the highlight is going to cancel down a little bit the blush and it's not going to be that visible of course for my highlight definitely two cheek by MAC which is my favorite highlight powder I'm gonna put right here here this gives the most beautiful sheen ever my favorite thing no matter it's summer spring or it's just winter lovely okie doke that is for the face on my lips, I really, really don't know what I'm gonna do. Definitely, it's going to be nude because the eyes are super, super dark. But I will gonna see and I will gonna start with the I lips. love this lip combo because it do my lips really, really bigger than usually are. Brownish nude, brownish lip pencil. Really dark nude, brownish. apply on the corners on top of that and fill inside I fill with lip liner this is by Essence Soft Rose one of my favorite and definitely lately my favorite one of my favorite lipstick L'Oreal Color Rich Serum S10 S1000 it's set 1000 Satin Pink I really don't know what I'm talking about. It's gorgeous pink. You can see I already have for a week. Lovely. It's, I think, the beautiful lipstick ever. And for this combination of the lip liner, And um, oops. lipstick, I love it. And for this lips, I will not going to put. Ooh, I will not going to put lip gloss. Just this one. And this is the done look. I hope you like it. If you like it, post comments down below and thumbs up. And thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial. See ya. Bye-bye.